So I grew up in a small town in Alberta, Vegreville, where times were tough. And I, I really wanted to do something that would make me some money. And I knew that I had to get it. I started earning something, so I fell across the street. This is after high school. You finished high school. Actually, I flunked. <laughs> flunked high school. All right, way to go. Anyways, all right, carry on. I won't get into that part. Because you didn't have Latin. Yeah, okay, we know that story, but all right, whatever else. Then the fell across the street. What did he try to do for you? His name was yeah, with the Beacom family, and he was manager of the local bank in Montreal and offered me a job. And I just, I, so I took the job and then the bank said, well, uh, we think you should go to Calgary because mm -hmm. there was more opportunities for you down there. And I decided on the way to Calgary, I heard about the oil boom in Alberta. And about what date, what year was that? That would have been, just a minute, let me think about it, 19... Around 1950. Okay. So I was tired of the bank because it seemed to be so slow and not the opportunities, in spite of what they tried to convince me of, yeah. were, I felt I had more in, in me than looking after pe other people's money. <laughs> so on the way down, I heard about this wonderful oil boom in Alberta. And we had a family friend who worked for Imperial Oil office in Edmonton. Okay. So I, I applied. I said, I think I should get a job with Imperial Oil. And that was the time when they were just transitioning in, into uh, uh, Punch card technology. Oh my God, IBM punch cards. IBM punch cards. So I I seem to grasp that very quickly. And Your mind for numbers, it's still I, there. My mind for numbers. Yeah. So I, I was transferred to Calgary and uh, then then there was a way, there, there's, there's Toronto in there somewhere. Yeah. Because that's where you met mom. That's right. Because it started into internet technology and I had such a mind for it. Computer, it was computers back then. Internet is a long ways away, but yes. it's computers and where we are today it has evolved to internet. But so, so I, I, uh, they said, we, why don't you, I think we should put, transfer you to Calgary and uh, there was Toronto this, is, this many years ago but there was Toronto that's right it was Toronto was your big move because that's where you met mom that's right transferred to Toronto and they were also really into internet technology computers yeah computers and that sort of thing and I had a mind for it so I, uh, I, I like the job, I like the challenge and, the, and it, 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 dealing with numbers and the new technology appealed to me. So it, it produced not a bad lifestyle and, and career. How many years did you do? Do you remember how many years at Imperial Oil working for one company, the bulk of your working life? I think you did. Do you remember how many years? Because I know. <laughs> Tell me. 35 years. 35 years. But you've been retired longer than you've worked there. You've been retired for like 45, almost 50 years. Well, hang on, you're 94 now. You started at age 21. You retired at age 55. Oh, my God. Yeah, you've worked. You've been retired 45 years, and you only worked there for 35 years. And But I was very fortunate because the new... Technology, the internet brought things available that suited my mind, and uh, it's a lot to soothe your mind. I mean, it's a lot to grind your mind to remember all those years. But from what I understand, a, a, a career that's produced 
well, it's, it's raised our family and, uh, and oil and gas is what the Shaws found their success, but now they're trying to take oil and gas away. Oil and gas, petroleum, bad, according to our prime minister. So who knows what the world's going to be like because uh, we sure liked oil and gas, eh, Dad? Absolutely, because I was uh, spent 1979 to 81, I was transferred to uh, Exxon Corporation for two years. That was their move to Manhattan. You worked in Manhattan. We lived in New Jersey. Remember that? That was that's great times. Right, that's right. And all the family came with me. Uh, so, it was an adventurous time for me, very challenging to my mind, yeah. and in the long run, I ended up like, how many years did that say? 54 years? 35 years with Imperial Oil, and, but you've been retired for about 45 years, so yes. uh, they're still paying your pension, and they're wondering... What the hell? How did that work out? But uh, we're not arguing, right, Dad? No, no.